Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the eagerly awaited Season 3 of Diablo 4, set to ignite our gaming screens from January 23, 2024. So, mark your calendars. This season promises to kick off the new year with an epic start, running until mid to late April 2024. Diablo 4 Season 3 is not just another chapter, it's the first major content drop of 2024, and it's shaping up to be a game changer. Expectations are high after the thrilling adventures of the previous seasons, and Blizzard is not holding back. What's in store for us? Well, get ready for a new set of challenges and an intense storyline that continues to evolve the dark and compelling world of Sanctuary. We'll face new threats, engage with fresh mechanics, and get our hands on some enticing loot. But that's not all. Season 3 is also bringing the much-requested leaderboards feature to life, adding a competitive edge to our demon-slaying escapade. As we battle our way through Season 3, we'll have the opportunity to compete in the Gauntlet, a new, weekly challenge dungeon introduced once we hit World Tier 4. The Gauntlet is no ordinary dungeon. It's a fixed seed, non-linear battleground that demands we utilize every skill in our arsenal. The best part, the layout and monsters remain consistent across runs, allowing us to strategize and optimize our approach for maximum efficiency. And here's a twist. Loot only drops at the end of the gauntlet, but as we navigate its treacherous paths, we'll collect proofs of might to boost our scores. These scores aren't just for bragging rights. They'll place us on the newly introduced leaderboards, where we can compete solo or in a party across various classes. And in both non-hardcore and hardcore modes, the top scorers each week will not only dominate the leaderboards but also earn a place in the Hall of Ancients, a permanent record of the bravest and most skilled players in Diablo 4. So, are you ready to join the fray and carve your name in the annals of Diablo 4's history? Stay tuned as we dive deeper into what Season 3 has to offer in our upcoming videos. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more updates, and let us know in the comments what you're most excited about in Diablo 4's Season 3. A specific theme for Season 3 hasn't been explicitly detailed yet. However, Diablo 4 consistently follows a dark, gothic theme that revolves around the battle against demonic forces in the world of Sanctuary. This theme is expected to continue and evolve in Season 3. New Features The Gauntlet, a new weekly challenge dungeon where players compete for high scores, with both solo and group runs. It is described as a fixed seed linear dungeon where speed and efficiency are key. Players will use their own characters and builds in the gauntlet, and loot will only drop at the end, not from defeated enemies. Leaderboards Separate leaderboards will be introduced for different classes, hardcore characters, solo and group runs. Players with top scores will be rewarded with special cosmetics and their accomplishments recorded in the Hall of Ancients, a permanent leaderboard. Helltide Event, an intense event occurring for 55 minutes every hour, offering thrilling challenges and battles. Players have the chance to earn item level 925 gear during this event. Competitive System, a new competitive system called Laternoi is introduced, a non-linear PvP dungeon where players strive for high scores. Improvements and Updates, Patch 122, an update addressing bugs related to Season of Blood, as well as improvements to quests, playability, and accessibility. The patch also introduces five new malignant rings obtainable in both seasonal and eternal realms. Gold trading system improvements, specifically for console players, aiming for a smoother and more satisfying trading experience. Itemization overhaul, plan changes for Season 4, focusing on making the process of finding and acquiring gear more meaningful and exciting, including the introduction of crafting or item modification mechanics. The Midwinter Blight event begins on December 12, 2023 and will run until January 2, 2024. This gives players three full weeks of engagement with the event. Event Description Midwinter Blight is a limited-time seasonal event taking place during Season 2 of Diablo 4. The event unfolds amid a devastating storm that has overtaken the Fractured Peaks region, bringing a new wave of evil with it. Snowy Fractured Peaks The event is set in the Fractured Peaks, which will be enveloped in a freezing storm. This storm not only adds a seasonal twist to the environment but also sets the stage for the unique challenges and encounters players will face during the event. Holiday-themed enemies New quests and activities are part of the Midwinter Blight, where players will encounter holiday-themed enemies such as Frigid Husks and Blight Fiends. These new enemy types add a fresh dynamic to the gameplay, offering new combat experiences and challenges. A notable addition is the new boss, the Red Cloaked Horror, who will frequently appear in the Fractured Peaks region during the event. Defeating this boss offers a chance to obtain powerful loot, adding an element of reward to the challenges posed by these new enemies. Rewards Participation in the Midwinter Blight event brings various rewards, including Cosmetics for weapons Players will earn trophies for defeating the Red Cloaked Horror's minions, which can be exchanged for cosmetic transmogs in Kyovash. Back Trophies 
These can be unlocked by defeating enemies during the event, adding to the collection of player achievements. Exclusive Elixir this elixir not only provides a 10% bonus XP gain but also grants unique effects when used in the Midwinter Blight event area in the Fractured Peak. This addition enhances the gameplay experience and rewards players for their participation in the event. The Midwinter Blight event in Diablo 4 promises a thrilling blend of new challenges, enemies, and rewards, all set against the backdrop of a winter-themed Fractured Peaks. This seasonal event is sure to bring a festive yet formidable atmosphere to the game offering players both a visually stunning environment and engaging gameplay experiences, quests and objectives, new quests and activities. Players participating in the Midwinter Blight event will have access to new quests and activities specifically designed for this event. These quests are expected to be thematically tied to the event, adding to the immersive experience of the holiday-themed setting. Encountering the Red Cloaked Horror A significant part of the event involves encountering and battling the Red Cloaked Horror, a new boss who will frequently appear in the Fractured Peaks region. Successfully confronting and defeating this boss will play a central role in the event's objectives, special rewards and loot. Cosmetics for weapons Players will earn trophies for defeating the Red Cloaked Horror's minions, such as Blight Fiends and Frigid Husks. These trophies can be exchanged for an assortment of cosmetic transmogs back in Kyovash adding a collectible and customization element to the event. Back Trophies Additionally, players gain access to a variety of back trophies, which can be unlocked by defeating enemies during the Midwinter Blight. These trophies serve as both a reward and a symbol of the challenges overcome during the event. Exclusive Elixir An exclusive elixir introduced in the event grants a 10% bonus XP gain. Moreover, it provides unique effects when used in the Midwinter Blight event area in the Fractured Peaks, enhancing players' experience during the event. Limited Time Content Limited Event Duration The Midwinter Blight event is a limited time content available from December 12, 2023 to January 2, 2024. This period is the only time players can experience and engage with the event-specific quests, activities, and challenges. Exclusive Event Challenges The event offers unique challenges such as confronting the Red Cloaked Horror and his minions, which are exclusively available during this limited time frame. The challenges are tailored to the snowy, festive atmosphere of the Fractured Peaks during the Midwinter Blight. Event-specific rewards The rewards, including cosmetic transmogs, back trophies, and the exclusive elixir, are uniquely tied to the Midwinter Blight event and can only be earned during this period. These rewards add to the exclusivity and appeal of participating in the event. The Midwinter Blight event in Diablo 4 provides players with a mix of new quests, challenging boss battles, and unique rewards, all set in a festive, winter-themed environment. This event not only adds a seasonal twist to the gameplay but also offers exclusive content and rewards that can only be accessed during the event period. The Diablo 4 community is buzzing with excitement and anticipation for the upcoming Season 3 and the Midwinter Blight event. Players are particularly excited about the introduction of the Gauntlet and the leaderboards, which add a competitive edge to the game. The unique theme of the Midwinter Blight event, set in a snowy fractured peaks, has also sparked a lot of interest, with players looking forward to exploring the new environment and battling the holiday-themed enemies. In-game events or gatherings As of now, there are no specific in-game events or community gatherings announced around the launch of Season 3 or the Midwinter Blight event. However, these major updates typically see a surge in community activity with players organizing their own events and gatherings, both in-game and on community platforms like forums and Discord servers. There's a lot of speculation about the new features and challenges that Season 3 and the Midwinter Blight event will bring. Many in the community predict that the new season will further deepen the lore of Diablo 4, bringing more engaging storylines and quests. The Midwinter Blight event is expected to offer a unique experience with its festive theme and exclusive rewards. Compared to the previous seasons, Season 3 is expected to raise the bar in terms of content and gameplay experience. The introduction of the Gauntlet and leaderboards marks a significant progression in the game's competitive aspects. The Midwinter Blight event, with its unique holiday theme, stands out from past events, offering a fresh and seasonal twist to the game. Season 3 of Diablo 4 and the Midwinter Blight event are shaping up to be exciting updates for the game. With new challenges, quests, and rewards, these updates promise to enhance the gameplay experience and keep the community engaged. The addition of competitive elements like the gauntlet and leaderboards is a welcome development, adding a new dimension to the game. What are your thoughts on the upcoming Season 3 and Midwinter Blight event in Diablo 4? Are you excited about the new challenges and rewards? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to stay updated with the latest Diablo 4 news and content. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.